Pancakes is far and away my favorite. It has really? the word cake in it. <laughs> Shut up! You don't think Ryan is famous? Cousin Ryan. You gotta... Hey, what's up, YouTube friends and family? It's Cousin Ryan. P to the J. And you know what a chocolate lover my man is oh. here. So I am to chocolate what you are to Funfetti birthday cake. Ah, there you go. Straight yeah, up. yeah, yeah, yeah. I was curious where you were going with that. By the way, can we agree that one of the greatest commercial taglines of all time. All time? Gotta be in the top ten. Lego. My, my ego. Agree. Right? I mean, that's gotta Agreed. be way up there, right? Agreed. I mean, don't you guys agree? Like, way up there. Lego, my ego. What would be another tagline that would be... I, I, why am I drawing a blank? He right likes now? it. Hey, Mikey, that's a great. Mikey one. likes it. Yeah. Uh, I know that was kind of a serial one. I mean, I don't know if it'd be like crunch all you want, we'll make more. Oh, that's, that's a, a good a great one. one. That's a great one. Um, I mean, when you said Lego, my ego, I don't know. I think it's the same era. I mean, I thought uh, Zach the Lego Maniac. That's not really oh, a tagline, yeah. I know, but right, um, right. So it's like, where's the beef? That's where's the Wendy's. beef? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. That was a big. That was a big one. Um, but Lego Mago's got to be, like, up there. Oh, that's a strong flavor. It's got me concerned now. I actually agree with you. But remember the Frosty one back in the day that we did? Right, that wasn't horrible. That one wasn't horrible. Is that enough? Let me start. Um... Pizza, pizza. Oh, that that might be number one. Like, on, as far as you think about, but I'm gonna tell you why it's well. I mean, not number one. Lego, other, my ego though. It's got missing. ego in the where pizza, pizza. That could be anybody's. That's right. You have to know. That's a great point. What do you guys know? What pizza, pizza is from? Right. That's a good point. I hope you do. Yeah, but like, yeah, right. It's just one of the best. And what you gotta do, Ryan, is you gotta stir it. Yeah, you gotta stir it a little bit. Did you try a piece dry yet? I did not. So it's it's pretty dense. It's okay. it's crunchy for sure. I tend to be a crunchy cereal guy. Okay. Typically, but whoa! What? You are not kidding, right? Okay. Like, like, like imagine <laughs> like. Imagine if you imagine if you petrified Captain Crunch. <laughs> like, that's what it tastes like. like this is Dude, you have no destroy. idea. I promise you, I was about to compare this to Captain Crunch, like, but like ten times harder. <laughs> like, I'll be honest. It's whatever. Right. I agree. And it's it's fine. It doesn't taste bad. No, it's fine. It's not gross. Right. But it's not good. Right. I agree. The texture is too much. Mm -hmm. There's not enough chocolate flavor in it. Um, I can lay go of this ego mm. for sure. Yeah. You know how? Like I think grape nuts is the hardest cereal ever made. No. Oh, yeah. But I think that one was designed for you to like pour your milk and literally like. Get ready and then come back and then yeah. be ready. I feel like this one, you'd have to pour this, like, and then go do something for ten minutes and then come, come back. back. You see, they're they're using it as a ice cream sundae topping. Now, right see, here, that but... wouldn't be terrible. I don't know, but it's gonna be so hard though, man. Like too crunchy on your mm. ice cream. I don't know. I don't think I'm a fan of that. Definitely not my favorite chocolate cereal. No, I do love Eggo waffles though. And I know this may gross some people out, but so be it. I like to microwave them. I will stack them. I will wipe them all with some butter. Stack them and put them in the microwave. And then just cut them with a, like the whole stack with a fork. Mm -hmm. And they're soggy with butter. And I... Syrup? No, no syrup. Just butter, man. Just butter. I would have liked this to have a hint of the waffle aspect. Yeah, there was no waffle aspect in there at all. Yeah. Well, I'm not a fan. And I'm trying to remember. We have tried so many cereals on our channel now that I can't remember if I had tried the regular Eggo waffle cereal with Uncle Joel or right. 
I mean, I don't know why we wouldn't have. Right. You and I haven't done it. No. I don't think. Are you a waffles, pancakes, or French toast man? This question popped up on Facebook today. And it was just between French toast and pancakes. I, mean, I feel like they all have their place, but there is really something magical about French toast. Wow. Agree to disagree. Really? Yeah. I love pancakes. Don't get me wrong. But pancakes is far and away my favorite. It has really? the word cake in it. <laughs> um, so Birthday pancakes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. I love pancakes. So, I know. So, yeah, I just, there's something about pancakes that I like better okay. even than waffles. And French toast yeah. would be my least favorite of the three. They all have their place. I agree. Yeah. But when push comes to shove, I'm a, I'm yeah. a pancake man. Yeah. You know what? I'm, I'm just gonna. I've got mm-hmm. my little workbench over here in mm-hmm. our studio. And wouldn't it be nice if this sit the other way? Picture. Oh, we will. <laughs> I've got this picture up next to my workbench of Ryder and I on Christmas from like 19. Well, no, it would be 19. Why am I saying 19? Something. Like 2000. That's your house, dude. 13, yeah. Yeah, so there you go. That's that's Ryder and me long before we ventured onto the YouTubes. Yeah. Good kid. It's a great Good picture, kid. too. That's a fun picture. Oh, and, oh, and there's the snowman. snowman. Yeah. Man. Yep. I like that you're rocking the, the Adrian Peterson yeah, jersey. Yeah, like short yeah. sleeves in December. Yeah, this was, I think, New Year's Eve. Oh, yeah. wow. That's awesome. New Year's Eve or Christmas Eve? I think it was New Year's Eve. It was New Year's Eve. Because there's yeah. other pictures that go with that where we had streamers. Anyway. Getting off topic. Yeah, not that's great. Okay. Not great. No, that cereal is not no. recommended no, at no. all. I, you agree. can steer clear of it. Trust me on this one. I agree. I don't even think if you're a chocolate lover. Well, you are a chocolate lover. I, I know. No, I agree. And it's not good. I agree. Yeah. Go toward... If you're going to go toward a, like a newer chocolate one you want to try, you want to head move toward the uh, Frosty. Yeah. Wendy's Frosty. Yeah. But like we said, they need to just stay in their lanes. Right. People need to stay in their right lanes. Ego, just make make your amazing waffles. Mm-hmm. Chocolate chip waffles. Agreed. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> okay. No nostalgia here for me, man. None. At all. So, until next time, keep chasing your nostalgia. You filthy animals. See ya. I will say, right, there's a chocolate chip waffle at a place out in Occidental called Howard Station. Uh-huh. You know, sir, it's Cousin Ryan on the Hollywood Boulevard. You know, sir, it's bigger than any superstar. All of us bitch is some, some real to a bar. Show them sweeter than any chocolate bar. Boom! Hey.